صدق الله العظيم المتوحد في الجلال بكمال الجمال تعظيما وتكبيرا الذي نزل الفرقان على عبده ليكون للعالمين نذيرا She has respect for the profession. Whenever you call her to location, she will be at the location on time. And she doesn't complain. May I so rest in peace. It was more like a sister to me. We were very, very, very close. So like I mentioned earlier, I was one that ushered her into the industry. Because um, Moji is just a wonderful person. My relationship with her was real special because she's one of the most simple person I've met in my whole life. Friendship has been one waxing strong by the day. We traveled. We have traveled out of the country like two or three times together. She was someone that any, there's hardly any occasion that I do that Moji would not be there. She will always prove to be a friend. She taught me a lot of things. She taught me to save. She taught me to be forgiven. She taught me to to take life simple. God will bless them. God will be with them. Um, alone. So, so if you want wasaye, if you want puyaje, God will bless them. Ibiti ya wo ode. I met her a very long time ago and uh, she's a very wonderful person. She's my senior colleague and she was extremely very humble to me. She was one of the very few people that said to me, yeah, but you don't have to call me auntie, we're all age mates, even though she was two years older than me. You know, she was a very wonderful person. She was, she was very calm, very, very calm by nature, very, very calm Thank person, you. very nice person, very accommodating, very easygoing, you know, a very wonderful mother. She was a wonderful mother to her daughter. She's a wonderful friend to me. She's a nice person. She's my, she's my friend, she's my best friend. So I'm so happy for My name is Benita Nzeribe, a Nollywood actress. Thank you. Uh, Moji Olaya. I would say um, she like, I met her only once. I met her only once on a movie um, set. And she cast a knee in my heart. She, she just... She was like a big sister, and after the set, uh, she continued to call me. I was away when I heard about her death, and I just told myself I had to be here. She is, she has this humble spirit. You, except you're a witch or something, or a demon, that is the only way you would dislike her. And that's the truth. I don't believe in singing praises um, for the dead. But she deserves it. I used to sing praises to her when she was alive. She calls me and I'm like, you are a rare gem. You are something. This is, that's what I used to call her. Today she's no more, it hurts. But I pray that God will give the family the heart to be others because she is not one person that you will forget easily. She is a sister, she's a friend, more than a colleague. 
because um, even though we don't get to really see each other, we don't really get to talk apart from probably when we meet in parties or job when we're on location together. I remember vividly that Moji some few months ago before she got pregnant, we were together somewhere and I wasn't in a good mood so I didn't say hello to her. And so when I left the occasion, she had to call me. That bimbo, I saw you earlier. And, um, oh no, I said hello, but it wasn't like the usual way of saying hello. And she called me, like, Bimbo, what happened? You don't greet me like that. Is there anything? Did I offend you? And that's a Mojolaya for you. She always want to make peace. She's simple. She doesn't want to keep my leave. She doesn't want to fight. You know, even as private as she is, you know, she has her own people. And I talk to her on a private level, aside the industry, aside entertainment. She's my friend. You know, because we have common friends and we just talk. I, I, it's a great loss. It's shocking when I had it there because I was not able to be there on the day it happened. And the second day I got there, because of the closeness we had, and when I heard that they didn't want her to come, they didn't want the cops to come down here, I had to fight with a couple of people that were there. Like, please, let's not let our body rest there. She's a stakeholder in this country. Apart from the fact that she's an entertainer, you know, she's, she's, she's huge. She, she belongs to a body that is large in this country. Why don't let us please try every possible means. Let's bring her down here. And thank God today, you know, we're expecting our body. I just want to say that um, as shocking as this is, and Moji is such a dear friend, and it's shocking that um, this happened. We didn't wish for it. And every other one that, I'm ha that, I, that might have happened, we just pray that God in his infinite mercy should please uphold this industry. Keep us as an individual. Let's not lose our lives just like that. You know, God is unquestionable. Whatever happened, we can't question him. I just pray that um, as bad as this is, we pray that God should please avert this kind of, I mean, short life and um, sudden death from her miss. Yeah, she's my friend, my colleague. Uh, we are opportune to work together during the election and uh, we traveled to France together for an award. That was 2000, two years ago and uh, yeah, she's a very calm person. She's very humble. She's tolerant and uh, she's a nice person. Right in her own little way as a single mother. But for me now, she cannot continue what she actually said she wanted to do. So losing Moji in the industry for me is a minus one. It's a minus one because Moji is a fantastic and very strong person that nobody will want to miss as a friend or sister or, or mother. So I'll say for me, we lost Moji and that is very sad. No, this, this is a sad, sad thing. What, what, what I will, will I say is... We just didn't pray her. It's only prayer that we just have to pray for her. We have to pray for her, pray for her family, uh, pray for the children she left behind. And uh, nothing else. May I so rest in perfect peace. That's it. So. The Balkani, Olori Reni, Kolongoba, Foriji, Onetari Bani, Alak Moleni, and the two neighbors who are long, Kilua, who are not there, who are not there.